another great moment in wrestling. Instead of Ric Flair walking onto a WWF pay-per-view in 1998 in Greensboro, Kid Rock is going in the Hall of Fame. <laughs> I, and everybody tweeted me that, and I'm not going to go off on a, I'm not going to go off on a rant here, uh, at least a long one. But I mean, you know, Donald Trump's in it. So what can can we expect? But in in all honesty, and I guess it, I don't know whether Cindy Lauper ever was interested, or did they ask her once? And she, I don't know. But I guess they got to have a celebrity. But Jesus Christ, Christ, the 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 Baba Da Ba thing was like the fucking you know, it was a novelty song and it was catchy and it was great entrance music. It was like the 1963 Hollywood Argyles hit Alley Oop. It was a great novelty song. And uh, then uh, 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 Lonely Road of Faith loved it, actually, because of the video. But that was nice. Otherwise, I, all he does is, is do Skinner, and I don't know what the fuck. And But what a right-wing crackpot. And now he's not. I thought he was some fucking trailer trash fuck, right? No, he grew up, apparently, as everybody's tweeting me, as a rich white kid and just pretends to be a trailer trash fuck to appeal to all the other trailer trash fucks like Sarah Palin. <sighs> but it, So Pete Rose is looking better and better every year. Now, let's really think about this, though. If you really were going to have a celebrity wing of a Hall of Fame, like, who are the no-brainers to you? Cindy Lauper, Mr. T, who's in, Andy Kaufman. Who else yeah. would you put in? Uh, Tyson. Tyson, uh, as, a, yeah. as a celebrity um and then why do you really have to have celebrities do they have celebrities in the baseball hall of fame no no reputable or, hall of fame has a celebrity wing or a warrior award or, or anything else well, so then after i got finished putting kaufman and tyson in i believe i'd close fucking thing down because it all does get them in trouble <laughs> Will Kid Rock get cheered at a WWF Hall of Fame ceremony event? Or no. WWE, I'm sorry. Oh, no, he's going to get booed. And by the way, how is it a wing if there's no building? They're going to be in the celebrity wing. What, what wing? Well, but but then here's a, it could be a branch, except <laughs> that fucking Kid Rock's family tree doesn't branch. He's going to get uh, booed out of the place. <laughs> You're not trying to start something here, are you? Here on on the cult cast, you know what kind of pull we have over people, Brian. Where we have called fury and anger and vengeance down on people before here on the show. You're not trying to start a campaign here on the Jim Cornette Experience to boo Kid Rock out of the fucking building because of his goddamn obstreperous right wing views and the derogatory things that he had said about President Obama while embracing the ilk of Sarah Palin and Donald Trump and the rest of these fucking lunatics. You're not trying to start something like that, are you? I would never do anything like that. I'm merely pointing out that when they announced it the other day, a lot of people booed, and I just think those boos may grow a little louder as we get into WrestleMania season, where more fans will be congested into a very small area to let you know what they think. I, I would never condone such a thing.